What is up, everybody, and welcome back to the Hearthstone Brawl. So, last episode, we played as Nefarian, and now we're going to be playing as Ragnaros. Alright. Oh, these are actually pretty good to start with. Let's do it. So, none of these are real cards, and <laughs> probably a lot of these aren't, and I'm just going to, I'm not going to talk about which ones are real, which ones not, because most of them aren't. Um, but they're great. So we have Wind Fury, deals 6 damage for 3 mana, cast Corruption on all their minions, which is the next turn they all die. Uh, and yeah, but, and then what? Yeah, draw 2 and gain... F oh, here is the key card. So, costs 50, but 1 less for each damage we take. So once we get down to 10 health, it'll cost 0. So it kind of works like that. So let's summon up one of these guys, Magma Raider, and attack him. Okay. So pretty much, yeah, we have to wait until this thing just breaks, then we can deal 8 damage to any minion we want. But for now, we got to use some of our strong, weak, you know, playing card. Oh, all spells cost 3 less. Why, thank you. I'll just play our Flame Heart next turn then, for 0. Very good. Oh, he's going to do that. Is he going to attack my Magma Raider with it? Probably. Yep. Okay. Okay. So what are we going to do now? Um, we, we don't have enough to play these guys. Let's do that, though. Flame Strike will cost less. Oh, this thing will cost zero. Perfect. Play one of these bad boys. Attack him. Alright. That that card, I feel like it helps me more than it helps him. Electron. Three by five by five. Like, that's just not even fair. So many of these stats are so, like, just skewed. Alright, so yeah, the Son of the Flame is just crazy. Deals six damage. We get two of them. We have the Flame Strike. I'm saving until he plays something with like a bunch of whelps, because he has the Onyxia, which plays all whelps. He has two. He has two cards that will just fill his board with whelps. So I think I want to wait. It would be a pretty good time to use it now, because it would kill all of them. But oh, a Hunter Secret. Great. I'm assuming the Hunter Secret is probably like, um, probably like deal two damage when you're attacked. Yeah. Oh no. Attack a random other character. Oh, crap. Alright. Okay, let's get rid of this guy. There we go. I mean, we were just, we're really just trying to keep alive for a few more turns. And then we can start just going on a rampage, dealing 8 damage or something. Oh, come on, Razor Gore. At the start of your turn, give your minions plus 3 attack. We're using Lucifron. Definitely. Oh, God. Okay. We're using this guy. Cast Corruption. So then, um... His, his minions will die next turn. Alright. So what? Yeah, 7 and 11. Oh, man. Well, hey, the more damage he does, the quicker Goal Mag comes out. And let's see what he's got. Whenever your opponent plays a card, gain 2. Yeah, we used that, didn't we? Well, that's fine. We can kill that with deal 6. Let's see what other kind of tricks he has up his sleeve, though. It's really hard to tell what he's going to play when he has that freaking ability. Alright, so those two are gone. Let us attack him first, so we're not taking a bunch of damage. Deal six there. Boom. Now let's play the Wind Fury. Why not? I mean, like the Magma Rage is... The Magma Rager guy is pretty good, but... I always thought it was Magma Raider. It's my Magma Rager. Okay. Rager Pro. Uh, so we got the Lava Burst. Which I... Oh, there's Anixia. So close. We don't have enough mana for Flame Strike or for Baron Geddon to deal two to everything. But we do have a Wind Fury, which is good. Which is very good. So what we're going to do is we're going to go boop. We're going to go boop. We're going to go attack. There we go. That changes. Oh, shoot. I should have used that. Oh. Yeah. A tip. You can actually use the rage, summon the rage guy, and then also the die insect in the same turn. But I didn't do it. Okay. So let's really hope this hits him. No, you... Uh. Okay. Yeah, see, I wasted, man. I could have had another molten rage guy. I mean, he would have just probably attacked it with a welt, but it would have been gone at least. Well, we, yeah, we were one turn... Too early. All these freaking flame strikes and Baron Geddon and everything. 
That sucks. Alright, he gets a spell. He's up to 10 mana now. We get the epic music going. Okay, so now he just has an Ixia. Deal 2 to 2. Oh, well. That's pretty good. Okay. What's he got? Oh, god damn it. Yeah. Fills it all. Okay. So we can kill them all with the Baron. I think we're going to do that. We're going to do that. Indeed. We can't play the Baron and use the hero ability, which is a shame, but I'd rather kill all the whelps. Alright. Play the Baron. Alright, so we're down to 22 health, but if he attacks us, this guy will only cost 4, and then... Then he's dead. I hope. <laughs> I mean, he's played two of his, like, three, like, you know, max out the board cards, so I'm pretty sure our die insect will be a lot more effective now. Alright, what's he gonna do? Hit that guy? Okay. Ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. So, alright, we got, yeah, we're, we're in good, we're in good hands now. So, what I want to do is, I want to, what do I want to do? We need to play this guy. So we can do three or four, seven, that'd be nine. Damn. All right, we're doing this. We're doing him. Then we are doing, cause this guy's gonna die if I attack either of them. So I may as well attack this dude. And then we'll use this. All right, yeah, see it hit his face. Then that would have been Anixia still alive. But now we have a taunter. All right, if we play Gar, Whenever he takes damage, he summons a taunt, which is good. But I'm just hoping that he can't get rid of Golmag. Golmag's freaking crazy strong. Oh crap, he needs to draw a card. Does it show what he got rid of? No? It discards the other cards, it doesn't let me see them. I don't like that. Lava Burst, the deal 5 damage, we might just hit him with face for that. He has 43 health left. We can do that. We can hit them. Both players have spell damage plus two. So now these have plus two <laughs> six damage. This will do seven. I don't know what he's planning on. I just know Flame Strike will kill all of his minions now. My work is paramount. Okay. I, I'm feeling a Flame Strike coming on next turn. Just saying. Don't really know what this was all about. Arcanatron. Yeah, I feel like Golmag, when I play him, that's like game. Let's threaten him. That felt good. Deal five to two. Okay, right. And then what's he gonna do? Does he have a uh, deal fifteen damage? Because if not, he's in for a bad time. His turn's about to run out. Destroy a minion and deal. Oh, oh, his turn ran out. So, oh well, now we don't get the we don't get the extra. Oh, right, molten giant. Awesome. Um. Okay. So here's what we're gonna do. I don't know. What are we gonna do? I'd like to do this. Hmm. Let's do this first. Okay, so that killed off that guy. Let's kill off this guy like that. Play this. Play this. Attack him. I don't think he's going to have a very good time now. So this guy summons Emperor Torison when he dies, which is crazy. Emperor Torison makes it so, like, at the end of the turn, reduces all your cards by one mana cost. He's a real card, very much overplayed in the normal game. And they made this thing death rattle into it. I think he loses. Just gonna say. Our goal mag is, uh... Oh, he played Brawl! Destroys all minions but one. And he got his freaking thing. But we get Emperor Torison because of our death rattle. Wow! Okay. Wow, that sucks. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna attack this guy. We're gonna use this. Please, please, please. Oh, thank God. Play Gar, play our Flame Imp, and just hope for the best right now. Okay, we got 11 health left, and our Flame Strikes now cost less, which is good. Very good. Hey, if they could, like, both go down to 5, we could play them both turns, and we deal 8 to all <laughs> enemy minions. What's he got for a spell? Give a minion plus 2 health draw. Oh, he just wants to draw. Yeah, he's just powering me up. Okay. Is that all he's got? I hope so. Yeah, cool. Alright. Let's do this. Very good. Oh, yeah. I think we win. 
this guy, at the end, at the start of our turn, summons a legendary minion. It's like he doesn't get destroyed, he just summons another legendary minion. Which is absolutely insane if we can actually keep him alive. In 11, he has 11 health. Like, what can he do right now? His cards cost 3 less. Okay. Is that it? I think, I think he loses, everyone. He got so lucky with that brawl. He got so lucky. Could have been any spell. Oh, what's he got? Silence opinion, yeah. Well played. <laughs> Everything's in caps. That's the best. I don't think he's got anything. There, I mean, like, uh, there wasn't. There's not really much he can do. It's not like he has double flame strike in his hand. Destroy friendly. Oh my god. He had a freaking shadow flame, and he did it, but now he loses. Yeah. Because I could just attack him and then do that. <laughs> okay. So, that was fun. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Uh, I would like to do one of each of them again. So, that's what I'm going to do. Just kind of do, you know, part one, part two of each. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Until the next episode, I will see you all later.